Hi there, Jamie Keith here tonight at Teachers Tech. Hope everyone's having a fantastic night tonight. Tonight, I want to take a look at a new feature they just recently added to Google Docs, and that's connecting your Google Keep right through Google Docs, uh, right through the menu item. If you haven't used Google Keep before, I'll put a link down to a different video I have explaining how that works. But right now, I just want to show you this new addition, what they have added to Google Docs here. So let's get started on this little walkthrough. I'm just going to start this video inside Google Keep and just show you if you haven't used Google Keep Lots uh, to access it, you can go up to your Google Apps uh, Launcher and you can see I have it open and it's asking me to add a shortcut of it here. So if I wanted to add a shortcut, it will be here. And remember, you can if you use something a lot, you can drag them around here too. Uh, another way to get to any of your uh, programs is just to uh, type the name of the program. So this would just be keep.google.com and that will take you there too. So Google Keep is a app that allows you to keep organized all your ideas, whether it be personal or for a business. You can see a lot of times I'll add my video ideas quickly. Uh, I'll be on my phone or my mobile device a lot of times and I'll just quickly add some stuff on. I like how you can take pictures right inside Google Keep and you have it right in here. So uh, definitely if you're interested in learning more, check out the link of the video that I have before. But what I'm going to show you now is going over to Google Docs, what they did was they added something new and if you look under the uh, tools here you can see keep notepad and what it does is it brings it right into the side so you could see from google keep over here to over here you can see it's the same thing listed and what it able, enables you to do from this view is you can put things right inside your uh, doc from Google Keep. So if I wanted to add this, you can see I could add a document that I previously had or a picture. I could add it to the document very, very quickly here. I'm just going to delete that. I could also drag things over so you can just drag, uh, drag it right over to and it works the same way. Um, right up top here, you can take a note here. So if I was taking a note here, um, I'll just use this. I'll just say example here and I'm going to hit done. And what this is going to do is create a note inside my Google Keep. And it, what it does is creates a uh, link to this document that I'm on here. So if I go over to Google Keep, you can see if I open up my example here that I just started, the Google Doc is inside here. Uh, so any of these two, if you're inside Google Keep, you can push it over to Google Doc too. So if I, uh, if I just click these three little dots here, you can see copy to Google Docs. I can go from Google Keep that way. One thing that I wanted to show you in here, if you wanted to quickly bring in some text from an image here. So I took this picture right here um, of a new mount that I just uh, purchased and set up. So I just took this quickly before this video. And what I'm going to do is just click on the more and uh, actually, no, I'm just going to click on it and open it up. And then what I'm going to do is click on this and I'm going to grab the image text. So if you wanted to quickly get something into Google Docs, you could use the OCR uh, inside Google Keep. So if I sit grab it, you'll see down below what it did. It took all this text uh, and sometimes it's not perfect, but this looks like it did a, a pretty good job. You can always go through and edit it a bit after. But then what I can do at this point, if I go back over, I'll hit done over here. If I wanted that into my document after, I'll just drag this over now and you can see where did it go? I'm going to refresh that one more time here. I don't oh there it is so i'm going to delete this one more time i just didn't uh, i didn't refresh it before i put it in so i'm going to drag it over again and you can see i can quickly get the text into my document so there's google keep and google docs have always been connected this is just an easier way now to connect from google docs to uh, to google keep on it so it's a handy little feature if you're thinking about if you do use uh, this for a note-taking uh, device or just keeping track of your daily life and you wanted to put inside some into your documents or for students or teachers uh, maybe it's for research stuff and then they can as i said take images collect it, everything in google keep and then just put it through so i hope you might like this video here to Tonight. And if you find this useful, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, share it with a few people if you think this feature is a good feature to have. Uh, I do these weekly tech tips. And if you like what you see, please subscribe to my channel. I'll talk to you next time. Have a good night.